All right, hello everyone. Here we're back for hole number six tutorial here. So this should be, you know, a relatively easy par five, not to mention that you guys have played it many times. So you should have plenty of experience on this hole. So there's two ways to go about this. Certain guys will go to the left-hand side and certain guys will just lay up. Now what I recommend, especially with the way that the wind is pointed, is that you probably go to this left-hand side and go for this second fairway. Will require just a little bit of precision. Um, another thing is, you know, maybe power four ball could potentially be a nice thing for you as well. Um, here I have these origins. Why don't we just use one of these up? So you'll see that, you know, this will make things a little bit easier. Plus, the longer you get, uh, the straighter it will make that needle. So it will make it just a little bit easier as well. I'm going to use some power, but uh, this needle gets pretty jumpy. So I'm going to kind of back off my power just to kind of hone in on perfect ball just a little bit more. And it looks like I got a little bit too aggressive. So this is definitely going to hug the left hand, right hand side here of the rough. Um, I'm, I'm not terribly concerned about hitting it in the rough. It still gives me a chance to make this. So whether I'm in the fairway or the rough, I'm really not too work concerned about. Um, of course, I would have liked to have that perfect ball and had it shoot down the, uh, the side of the fairway there. However... You know, it's not, um, but you, you can see that we're going to have also a very straight needle. And that's one of the biggest reasons I want to kind of encourage you guys to go over to this side. Is to give yourself a straight wind angle to where it's pointed straight down towards the hole. And as I mentioned, you know, even not being in the fairway, we're still going to uh, have a very good chance to be able to make this. So let's take a look here. There's Max. I have no idea about Nirvana 4. I'm thinking maybe two and a half per ring, somewhere in there. Yeah, that's pretty spot on. So maybe two or three rings here. So we're at about two and a half rings. Missed my perfect ball. Uh, it landed long anyway. So probably needed three rings in that situation. Three point two, somewhere in there. I wanted to be a little bit careful, especially on my first attempt, you know, make sure you don't clip that rough. You can see that my mistake is so minimal that, uh, you know, it's a kick in. So you want to avoid trying to get too aggressive until you get that comfortability and they'll know that, oh, okay, well, I can definitely, you know, get a little bit more next time, especially after, you know, you've been in that situation. You'll be like, oh, okay, I remember this, so... Good luck with that hole, guys, and I'll see you guys momentarily for hole seven.